blow it. What? Here we are from another cheap, murky looking room. How you doing, Ro? Um, cold. Cold. We are in Athens. We booked the flight here for like, how much was it? Like a fiver, like a tenner? And then didn't think about the flight home for ages. It started off really cheap. <laughs> it's not cheap anymore. We're in Athens, we've just arrived. Travelling took a lot longer than we thought. And then we checked into our room and our room was maybe the coldest room in the whole of the planet. Colder than any tent I've ever come to. Yeah, absolutely. We've now switched rooms. It's much nicer. I know the Olympics. What do you know about Greece already, Rev? Uh, a long time ago there were gods. I know that Hercules was set here and I know that he <laughs> saved everyone. So thank you, Hercules. We really appreciate it. Thank you, Hercules. The place we're staying in is called Hotel Hostel Zeus. Which one was Zeus? The, the god of... The god of thunder. Oh, he lives in Mount Olympus and he's the god of gods. He's the god of all the other gods. Who was the one who fancied his mum? So we were walking through the city centre and it was just really like deserted and quiet. And then we searched for this cocktail bar, which is apparently really popular. And we walked down this like deserted street and then we got halfway down and there was just the busiest bar in the world. Yeah, everyone in Athens is in the bar. I saw a thing on the wall that was like, there's a QR code to get the menu. And I thought it might be like, over the top fancy, and you have to get it on your phone, it's all techy. But then she brought us a menu, and I was like, okay, no, it's just a normal bar. But then she showed us how to operate the menu, and it's not a normal bar, because you need to do this. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> what? What? Why? How was your cocktail, bro? Delicious. Delicious. Mine was red and tasted of nice. Mine was green and tasted nice, but all of it, which is really good. Ooh, that's not good. Who's that? Handsome. Handsome doggy. On a scale of one to the best, how good is that boy? Definitely almost the best, probably the best. Mm. Definitely a good boy. Are we trying to pickpocket? I don't know how many days. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Mm. Oh, you know? That is interesting. Mm. Mm. The whole time we were watching that happen, all I could think was like, what if I licked it? I got my tongue stuck to a freezer when I was really little. I wasn't even really little actually, I had no excuse. I was at least nine. And I had to eat yogurt instead of my packed lunches for a week. No. Yeah, it was horrible. National Garden. I don't really know. It's a garden. And it's a garden it's and it's national. Yeah. yeah, it's really nice. It's beautiful. It's such nice weather today. Yeah. The city is so different in the day to the night, which I think is true anywhere. <laughs> we were sat here and I was like, oh my god, there's like loads of oranges on the floor. And I was like, oh my god, there's an orange on the floor. And then we realised that the whole fucking garden is orange trees. You know when you see one and then all of a sudden you're like, oh, yeah. they're <laughs> everywhere. I can't believe we were walking around not seeing that before Idiot. this point. Is there any low hanging orange? There's the ones on the floor. A whole damn orange. A whole ass orange. A whole ass. What's an ass it's orange? orange. <laughs> what? It's a lion. A real lion. A real ass lion. Oh my god. Hey, hey, sir. Now we are going to. My sister recommended Philippu. Philippu Hill? I didn't read it properly, so I can't even begin to it's pretend a park to try. And it's a hill. It's a park and it's a hill, and the sunset is really nice over the. <laughs> Some guys just came up to us trying to sell us stuff and we're being a bit like, creepy. Oh, beautiful oh, beautiful ladies. ladies. And then, like, one of them tried to give Rose something and she just went, not today. <laughs> like, <laughs> bah, bah. And then he called yeah, him yeah. Shakira. Yeah, he tried. He was like, I know how I can get him to stay. I'll call them Shakira. Mm. <laughs> that is parking. I'm trying to make it up the hill for the sunset. Yeah. And the sun is setting quite quickly. Mm. But the light in all these little oh, roads is so nice. Yeah. We can't figure out which direction we're supposed to be heading in. There's lots of gates with padlocks on in the direction that we think we're meant to go. We're trying to get up there. Oh yeah, 
I think we found it. Yeah, I think we found, we found it. it. <laughs> Every city you go to, anywhere where there's somewhere to like go up and watch the sunset, you have this like shared thing with people. There was this couple in front of us the whole way up and every time we got to a point we were kind of looking at each other like, is this the way, is this the way? But as the sun was kind of starting to go down, there was like this little sense of urgency. Everywhere you go, every city across the world, at sunset, there are people trying to get to the highest point to watch it. You get to the top and there's just people from all across the world looking and sharing and taking pictures. So we're heading down now in the dark. That's the problem. Whenever you climb somewhere to see the sunset, you have to descend in the in dark. The dark. <laughs> I've climbed hills in the dark to see the sunrise. And as soon as the sun rises, you realize the route you should have taken. <laughs> it's much less embarrassing this way. I was a bit worried that us going up the hill and watching the sunset would mean that we'd committed to seeing that and nothing else. But it looks like everything's pretty well lit. That was absolutely worth it. That like, was. I would go home right now. That's like one of the most beautiful sunsets I've ever seen. In terms of just like the scenery, it's on par with when we were in Bologna and we climbed up the tower. If it was like that years ago I could absolutely see how um, a group of poor little humans might think that there were gods in the sky. Oh absolutely. We've got a tiny bit lost. We've stopped for some food. And we're having garlic bread. In God's restaurant. God's restaurant. We're in God's actual, in God's actual restaurant. restaurant. We only came in here because this guy did an incredible pitch. Not a pushy pitch, but a really well pitch. He said it would break his heart if we didn't come in. Yeah. And we think maybe he would go. We didn't get any desserts. And then the waiter was like, okay, well, I'll, I'll give you this on the house. And he just brought up a Greek yogurt. With honey. With honey. I've never needed anything more than I need this <laughs> right now. Oh my god. Is it it's really, really it's good? Absolutely good. We went to an Irish bar because it's just it's the kind of people we are. The only, no, it's not the kind of people that we are, Kim, actually. It's the kind of people that we discovered that we need to be because we've gone on so many trips now. Pop culture doesn't exist in uh, anywhere, anywhere else. else. Anywhere yeah. else. You can't just sit down and have a fucking pint. <laughs> No. I don't want to be bothered when I walk in a bar. Is no. that too much to ask? Yeah, I just want to go and get the drinks and sit down with me. Hello. Hello, little kitten. We were looking for somewhere on the maps and we were sat down staring at the phone so much that we didn't take the chance to look up and see the massive the side of the place we were looking for. Right, sorry. We were recommended to come here by um, my cousin's friend who lives in Athens. Cool. And it's supposed to have a 360 view of, of Athens. But it doesn't look like it's that tall a building, so I'm really interested to see what it's like in there. Yeah, me too. You think, oh, this is this is the man. This is the man shape. And then you're like, oh no, it's got massive tits. <laughs> we were just looking at up there. And I'm just like, I just, you know, time. Time. I like it's still there. That happens. When we went to see the sunset, we were looking at the same hills as so many people have. 
for thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands, 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 thousands of years. These were both poured as the same drink, right? And this is the same serving of drink. This one had head on it and this one didn't. But the guy was like, yeah, these are, these are acceptable. I don't think I have ever seen a sign that I understand less than that. And I've been to China. Bye, Zeus. The first night, I had to wear this big fluffy winter coat in bed because it yeah. was freezing. It was horrible. And the hostel guy wouldn't believe us. Yeah. Um, last night wasn't so bad, but that was mainly probably because we were drinking. Yeah. Today, we are leaving. But first, we are here. Wow. This version was built in around 500 BC, which but, yeah. is the ancient, the ancient Greek time. Yes. Before that, there was a really similar structure, and they reckon it was built in the Bronze Age, which was between 3000 and 1200 BC. They can see evidence of the previous one, but none like of it still remains. Crazy, you know? Yeah, how do they do that? Two guys walking up here, and one of them's obviously Greek, and he was like, So that table is where they reckon they used to do sacrifices and stuff. And his mate just went, Oh, nice. <laughs> How was your experience of the Rowan? Rowans? How was really, your experience of the ruins? Really good. Good? I just think it's amazing that we can just stand it. Yeah, I can't believe so long. as soon as you go up the slopes a bit, it's like you go up a level and suddenly the wind kicks in yeah. insanely. It goes from like incredibly windy to like almost, almost like threatening to storm. And then it's like this again. And I'm like, oh, it's because obviously like we, we did something wrong mm -hmm. and we got to fix it. And exactly. then the sun is back out now. Yeah. So. Like you step down that level away from the temples and stuff and then, now it's birds chirping, it's the sun, sunny. incredible. Yeah. No wonder they were scared of them.